Hello everyone! Welcome back to our Watershed Walk series. Thanks for being here with us as we share some of our fish sampling adventures from July. Fish sampling is part of our lake monitoring project and helps us to assess fish biodiversity at our monitoring sites. We also use an eDNA sampling method which allows us to test for the presence of certain fish species in the water without having to see them physically. We explain this in more detail in our most recent newsletter. But sampling with nets provides an additional hands-on experience and allows us to get some neat footage of the fish that inhabit these lakes. This is a beach seine net, which requires operation by two or more people. This method helps us assess the fish hanging out within the plant life close to shore. The net is walked wide and then brought back around to concentrate the fish into a small area. We also use a fike net, which can be installed and left to catch fish into its funnel shape while we carry out the other methods, such as operate the seine net and deploy minnow traps. A video from last summer goes into more detail about each of these sampling methods. We also spent an afternoon assisting the Hammond River Angling Association with their project to monitor smallmouth bass population abundance and distribution. This was a fun outing because it gave us the opportunity to practice our angling and fish identification skills. Once a smallmouth bass is caught and identified, its tag is shown here. The HRAA will recatch a sample of the tagged bass in the coming years to determine how far they've traveled and other details. If you're an angler, you can contribute to this project as well by contacting the HRAA when you catch a tag smallmouth bass. Just make sure to give them your location and the number on the tag. Thanks for watching, and thanks as always to our sponsors for making the work we do here at the KWRC possible. A shout out as well to the HRAA for the work they're doing and to ACAP St. John for lending us the nets for fish sampling. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on social media to keep up with our environmental endeavors. See you next time!